I must tell you, when people heard I was coming out to do an interview with you, you know what most people are interested in? Mm -hmm. Your wife's 3,000 pairs of shoes. How many shoes? How many shoes? Can you wear on 20 years? Exactly. How many can you? Well, uh, she uh, um, gets all kinds of, buys all kinds of shoes. She uh, has probably to change shoes twice a day. And then after a while, because she has to uh, um, probably um, 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 feel more comfortable. And there are parties where she can wear high heels. There are parties where she has to wear short heels. Good, Mr. President. 3,000 pairs of shoes. Oh, hundreds and hundreds of... 20 of years. Well, what? Those are collections for 20 years. But people look at those price tags still hanging from the dresses. People look at the price tags on the, they see the jewelry, they see the, you know, I mean, the, the cameras went into Malacanang, and they look at that and they say, here's while people are starving out in the street. Yeah, well, and, uh, and is that a logical conclusion? That we spent uh, this kind of money? Where, would, where did the money come from? I don't know. I Probably think it came from our private funds. Did they prove that it came from public funds? Did they prove that this was the reason why the people don't have any money? Then why did the, the income of the people increase from 736 to 10,000? I don't why think... Why did the uh, deposits in the bank uh, go up 35 times? Mr. President, I don't think that the equation is if only Mrs. Marcos had not spent the money on the shoes and the dresses that there would have been enough money there for the people. Well, I it, think... But it I is obvious. The question, so they are in, implying this. It's sir, really obvious. I think the question that people are raising is here, here is the president, here is the first lady, the governor of Manila. It seems somehow indecent. Oh, well, let's uh, say... I think that's the charge, quite yes, frankly. Uh, well, uh, it is, of course, uh, uh, something which um, compares with showing on television uh, 90s, brass, panties, and the like. You talk about the good breeding, well, that, that's it. Um, she probably was used to this when I was a um, young, uh, overspending congressman, <laughs> driving a, when I was courting her, driving a convertible and dancing around town like a uh, um, spoiled uh, bachelor. But I won't, I won't defend her. I will say that uh, uh, she uh, felt that uh, she had to uh, wear dresses in accordance with the occasion, that uh, her duty was not just to uh, uh, be a housewife, but to uh, represent um, the Filipino people proudly when they are in New York, when she has to talk to heads of state, when she has to go to a funeral of, uh, say, uh, Khrushchev or whoever else, but when shopping, she has to go to Rome and meet the Pope. But shopping trips, Mr. President, shopping trips in which she takes advances oh, come of $150,000, 200000 The shopping $200, trips are all $200. fabricated. Like saying that she went to Japan and bought half a million dollars worth of, of, uh, of pearls. That's completely false. That's or, a lie. Or four and a half million dollars expended over one month in New York. Well, uh, probably it was not all spent for her. What is the proof that this was all spent for her? Just because she took it out of her account? Took it out of her account? Of her account, I understand that this is what they are proving. Well, they're, they're saying two things. They're saying, one, that she had kind of an unlimited account with the Bank of the Philippines, that she could draw enormous quantities of money, and two... That's false. That money was taken out of the That's military intelligence fund. Oh, completely false. Uh, that is where, again, uh, the foreign correspondents may have been mistaken. There is no such thing as a military intelligence fund except that which I control. I mean, what they're talking about, uh, there, there, there are very careful notations by your wife's secretary, Faye Jimenez, in which she accounts for each item, and there are, well, expenditure, uh, there are expenditures of $10,000, $50,000, $100,000 for one painting, I believe, an expenditure that exceeded a million and a half dollars. Oh, I seriously doubt that. I, I haven't seen this uh, matter. If it is a case in court, I don't want to talk about it. But I can tell you uh, this, that um, 
we never spent uh, government funds for our personal purposes. If we did, we replaced them immediately. I may have committed many sins in my life, but stealing money from the people and from the government is not one of them. 